Hey guys, this is Joel here from joelwebsites.com. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to create a website using HTML. So I'm not going to use WordPress or any other CMS. I'm just going to use pure HTML so that uh, you will understand how to create your own website using Bootstrap and other technologies. So I'm going to use pure HTML. I'm going to show you all the basic code that is required in creating a new website. So if you are new to my channel, don't forget to go to joelwebsites.jothemes.com or for now you can go to joelwebsites.com I post all coding related articles on my blogs so I'm basically trying to export all my articles to my WordPress website so soon this website is going to be up and ready so joelwebsites.jothemes.com do come here so let's get started with the video guys peace in the link of the video i will in the description of the video i'm going to provide you some links that will help you get you web hosting that will help you get web hosting at a very affordable rate okay so you yeah, i'm just copying the link for you guys in case you want web hosting at a discounted rate So guys, I'm just going to give you an idea about what files I'm going to be creating. So here yeah, I'm going to create a new folder with all the website files inside. I'm using my htdocs, creating a new folder called my website. So I've created this folder inside the htdocs. So if you are new to XAMPP, you might find this a bit confusing. So XAMPP server is where you can artificially host a website on your own computer just to check whether the files are working fine this is a local server to host your website you have to just copy paste this files onto your hosting and your website should be live you can take help of your hosting provider they will provide you support with copying the files to the website hosting so let's get started by creating the HTML files so what I usually do is I just copy the templates there are several templates available online so instead of wasting time in creating everything from scratch what I would recommend you to do is to save time and download a bootstrap template so here we have thousands of free bootstrap templates Just have a Google search and here in start bootstrap.com you should have ready made templates for your website. So just select a template that suits your business needs. If you are looking to create an admin panel just go for SB admin. Here there is an admin panel layout. If you are trying to create a front end go for the stylish portfolio or something like the business casual and there are many more other options so just go for the one that suits your needs what I'm going to do is I'm going to go for the simple one that is one page creative theme so let's go to preview and download so here we see that the preview page has opened here you will find all the information and all the comments that people have given for this theme so just click on live preview if you would like to live preview it so in the meanwhile I'm just going to download the file as the page loads so here is the template this is what your website should look like here you can replace all your text with whatever you have for your business you can just type in whatever keywords and the sentences there as per your business here you'll have to change the images i'm going to show you how to change the images and the text on this website it's going to be quite easy this is a single page of website there are very few links so whichever link you click on is going to take you to that particular section this is one of the basic uh, one of the most easy ways to create a website i mean it's very simple and 
the theme you see is quite professional guys i'm going to be linking this particular theme in the video description also don't forget to check out the hosting at a discounted rate so here we have our file downloaded i'm going to go to the folder where the file is downloaded i'm going to cut it and paste it to my directory that is the xamp folder guys if you have any doubts or questions please mention that in the comments i will surely help you out so here we have the file so i'm just going to cut and paste it outside so if i go to my server or if i double click on this file i should be able to open a website so you see that the website is loaded from my computer itself now i'm going to show you quickly how to make changes if you want to see the website running on xam just copy this my website and open local host and your website should open as um usual so i'm going to show you step by step how to change images and how to change the text first i'm going to show you how to change text on your website because it's very important to change the information that is displayed so to suit your business needs so guys just open the folder where you have extracted your files and open it with a text editor you need to open the index file with a text editor open with brackets so this is what you should see on your brackets editor yeah i'll explain to you step by step about what all things are there in the html file this is the html wrapper so if you uh, compress this you will see that all the code is included in the html wrapper i'm just going to increase the font size a little bit so that you will able to see the code properly so you see that the first line is 1 and the last line is 281 so first we have the header section here if you click on the tag you will see the opening and the closing is highlighted in light green i am using the text editor called brackets you can use the text editor of your choice but i choose to use brackets so in the header you will have to put in information like meta tags so you you can put in a meta tag so that your website will have better seo so here you need to type in the tag so you have a business of pancakes Uh, i apologize because my spellings are not right but just type in the relevant keyword so suppose if you have a website where you want to sell black tops so make sure that you are putting in the keywords black tops in this so that whenever a person searches for black tops in google your website will have a chance of getting featured on that search result so there are other files you don't need to pay much attention these are the library files most of them and some are files that will change help you change the website design so for now we are not changing the website design here you will need to change the title for your website title will have to be changed here this is where your website title goes it will be wrapped under the titles tag here you you will have options to change the navigation of your website so let's change this to about one just to show you about how the website will change here you see that the text has changed to about one 
the best way to change text is suppose if there is a term like favorite you just need to control c copy and open the file that is your index file and control f and paste so here you have the text favorite sometimes there may be multiple uh, pages or multiple places where the word favorite is written so you need to be aware that you're changing the text in the correct place so similarly you just need to change the text yeah i'm going to show you an example just make sure that the text you're adding is equivalent in length so now this is a long sentence so make sure that your sentence your typing is as long as this one so i'm just going to show an example Uh, please mention anything about your business i'm just showing you how to change the content my objective is to show you to change the content make sure that the whatever is written on your website is in favor of your business and is attractive in some way and is pleasant to read so here you see my text hi guys this is a new sentence have that i've added after deleting the old sentence so yeah you, this is the main call to action so just mention the important things on top make sure that all the important things are try to be mentioned on the top and the website and on the bottom just mention about the extra things you need to update your phone number i'm just going to show you how to update your phone number and your email address because that is one of the most important thing this is my phone number this is my email address in case you have any doubts or questions please mention please send an email to joel j fernandez Here we have my phone number and my email address. So this is the perfect business website. Really superb design, very simple to make. You just need to upload your files to the server. I recommend you to buy Bluehost because Bluehost is one of the best hosting services. It will be linked in the description. Okay. please use the link in the description to purchase hosting as it supports my channel so guys this is bluehost there will be great deals linked in the video description so do check that out this was all for the video guys peace i hope that you enjoyed the video if you have any doubts or questions please mention your doubts and questions in the comments i and if you want help in creating your website please send me an email or comment in the comment section i will help you create a website from scratch i won't charge any money if you purchase the hosting services from the link provided in the description so thanks for watching guys peace out see you in the next video